that thing was X input plus. If anyone is wondering, probably not, but what, you know, it's worth explaining <laughs> because that's what I couldn't get it to do the first time I used the app. Um, it was more of a pain in the ass than anything. So I'm glad and I welcome the fucking sound because that means the uh, controller is set up how it's supposed to be. Right, motel. So the next stop is the Alcamelia Hospital, or I'm sorry, Brookhaven Hospital. Even though it's called Alcamelia in the first game, but uh, whatever, you know, to each their own, right? So we got to go around and uh, kill as many enemies as we can to go for that uh, possessed ending. It probably won't happen. I probably didn't rack up enough points anyway. But here's for a hopeful outcome. We're doing good on time, that's for sure. So, But it's not time that... Uh, it's ranked on, <clears throat> I mean, they do uh, grade us on it, but it's not like the determining factor for the ending that we're trying to get. Yeah, fuck you, dogs. I just love the flamethrower. It's so satisfying. <laughs> Although, I'll say I prefer the SMG over the flamethrower. Just because SMGs are fucking awesome. The flamethrower is kind of like the alien flamethrower that Ellen Ripley uses in the uh, Alien franchise movies. Fuck, I should have kept going. <laughs> right we could go into heaven's night and there's like um i believe there's a health item in there this is all basically just reused uh assets from two but not it's in its entirety they were able to cut it out so to not take up as much data on the DVD no I'm trying to fucking go bowling alley yeah, that's where I'm trying to go.
apparently she gets tired using the flamethrower. Wow. So there's literally nothing back here, but they're called, um, I forget what they call rooms like that. <clears throat> In this particular case, it's not a room, obviously, it's more of a section of the level. Uh, they're called kill rooms. They're made, intended to drain you of your items or completely flat out get you killed. <laughs> But we need a high enemy kill count to get the ending we're trying to achieve. So that's why I went out the way to uh, kill the doggies. You definitely uh, have an easier time with hard mode if you uh, unlock an unlimited weapon first. So maybe it was a good thing we uh, we played the first playthrough on easy. That way we uh, unlocked the flamethrower. I thought the lightsaber is pretty cool too, but we didn't uh, kill the last boss or deliver the final blow with a melee weapon, so... We'll unlock it this time, I guess. Oh, fuck. Forgot about these possessed nurses. I think these are my least favorite enemies <laughs> next to Pyramid Head and the nurses. They're just freaky, man. They weren't even that freaky in uh, the first Silent Hill game. But these, I don't know, man. I just... Ugh. Oh, yeah, something about the medical records. I'm not sure why they mentioned that. Like, why even bother, right? Stanley We never meet Stanley <clears throat> He's just some guy that writes uh, Heather Love uh, Not 
Well, I wouldn't say he writes love poems. He writes, he confesses his love for her, or it's more of a obsession. I forget the elevator does work in three. Extra costume password, touch my heart. Oh, wow. <laughs> so, uh, I mean, I've discovered them through the internet, of course. So I've, I've unlocked pretty much all the ones that come default with the game. But I, I didn't know you can uh, find them in the game. That's kind of neat. But who has time for that? I don't, at least. <laughs> so you want to equip the perfume in order for enemies to um, become a, more attracted. Or to attract more enemies. Or make them spawn or whatever. Which will, which will help us with the ending we're trying to get. You're supposed to figure that out. <laughs> We're not in 2003 no more. 2022, we have the internet at our disposal and our fingertips. So guess what? I'm fucking looking it up. I don't care. <laughs> On hard mode, it's different than normal mode would be. So they're not the same passcodes. Even if you figured it out on normal. Which I guess serves for replayability. I am a firm believer that if you are playing this game for the first time, do it without help. It's more fun that way, but if you've beaten it before, then what's the point? Oh, cool. Now we can see it? See, this was taken out of the original playthrough. Or maybe it was because the fix put it back in. But we weren't able to look at the tattoo. Start time is my key. Or maybe it's different on the... On hard mode, riddle-wise, anyways, not action. Oh, fuck. She just blasted me, yo.
Damn, they actually run <laughs> in hard mode. Or it might be because I'm using the perfume. So it could be that. We're making them attracted to us. I don't think I've read this one. Huh. There was a tattooed guy on that rumpled bed. Not anymore, though. That alarm clock and filthy bag are his. Ah, uh, but don't misunderstand. I haven't done a thing. I didn't hate him, though he was a liar. Shall I write something of my own on my chest since I can't cut it open to show you my heart? I love Heather. No, something a bit more forceful. I love Heather isn't enough for what I feel. Oh, what tender emotion this image brings. Stanley, you're fucking nuts. Sure. Eleven. Three, I want to say. Because it's not at five. Hmm. Uh, is it even 11? I don't know. <laughs> the start time is the key. Mm. What does that even mean? Okay, fuck this. I'm looking it up. <laughs> Uh, briefcase, let's see. On hard difficulty, the time the clock is set to is still the answer. However, it must be converted into military time out of 24 hours. It is assumed that the time is set in the afternoon, so simply add 12 hours to this time set on the alarm clock. Oh, okay. So... Military time. So that would be 2303, right? Ta da! So glad I have the flamethrower. <laughs>
Major calls. Ugh, don't you hate that when you're in the middle of gaming? It's better than your kidneys exploding, I guess. Do the fucking damage, bro. And it's only a revolver. I bet you it's a fucking 45. That's why. Nine millimeters don't do that much damage. What am I saying? It's a gun. They'll fucking kill you in one bullet. <laughs> hey, this perfume works, man. We could wear this, take less damage, but the point is to take more damage so that we achieve the ending, hopefully. The possessed ending. Ah, uh, nurse's station. That should be interesting. It's locked, though. Locked. So that means we have to go... into the elevator again. She missed. This was a kill room. Because unless you had a guide, you would know that room was meant to uh, destroy you. I gotta sit upright. I'm gonna get a fucking hunchback. Eh.
That's kind of creepy. <laughs> and there it is. Submachine gun. You don't get it. You don't get enough ammo though. You get like one clip. That's it. Six seven four three. Is that what that says? Oh no, Stanley, your doll. It's broken. That came out of nowhere. Oh fuck me, the umbalazo. It hurt so much I said it in Spanish. Hello? Claudia. No, I'm not- Don't lie to me, Claudia. You're always trying to run from your responsibilities. Have you come to apologize? Or maybe you still don't realize how foolish you've been. The salvation of all mankind. Ah, what a ridiculous dream. Wait, just listen to me for a second. I've heard enough from you already. How did you turn out this way? Where did I go wrong? Listen to me already. I'm not Claudia. You're not Claudia. My name is Heather. Heather. Who are you? Leonard Wolf. I'm sorry. I thought you were my daughter.
Claudia is your daughter? Oh, so you know her, do you? Are you one of her followers? No, never. When I find her, I I'm... I can feel the hatred. What? Behind your words, the anger. You plan to kill her, don't you? I'm sorry, but she... She killed my father. She's a fool, but she's still my daughter. I was going to forgive her if she changed her ways, but I see it's too late. Heather, will you help me? Help you? I'm locked up in here, and I must stop Claudia. Where are you now? I'm not sure myself, but the door is at the end of the hall on the second floor. I think I can be of help to you. I have a seal. Please. A seal? <laughs> Uh, second floor. Is that where Leonard Wolf is? No, he's not. Because we still have to enter the Nightmare World Hospital. I hate that place. What the fuck? Oh, you're supposed to find one of the notebooks here. Well, if you're into the Stanley thing. This is a kill room. How satisfying. <laughs> I've noticed they give you a lot of health items in hard mode. It's like they know you're gonna get damaged. <laughs> come from
don't open. I'm getting a pulse, but just barely breathing. Why? What is keeping that child alive? Yeah, because she was doing the schmack. That's why she was a little weird. And then we got this guy. Pumping some weird shit. <laughs> oh, hello. And there's a nurse uh, strung up or something. start this shit again. Definitely not making Hawaiian punch, that's for sure. The hand outside the window. Ew. I guess burning all those enemies tires her out. <laughs> Fuck. So much burning. Ah, this is a crazy room. Oh. The door won't open. I can't even make it budge. What the hell? What the hell is right? Oh my goodness. Ah. We gotta get the fuck out of here. Oh, let me out, let me out, let me out. Whew. I think we do or can die in that room. I haven't looked it up, but I have a feeling that's what's in store for us if we stuck around long enough.
Yeah, so in normal mode, it's locked. In easy mode, it's not. It's like a puzzle that they get rid of. In hard mode, it's even harder to figure out. But I knew there was something up with uh, the numbers and stuff. The Lark's child lost all his words and walled himself up all away, heart and mouth, both locked up tight in a cage where none want to stay. Yeah, and then there's like little clues and stuff. The Wren, with pure heart as yet unrefined, makes us laugh with his feeble lip smacking, but still we all know he shall never grow old, and he knows not how much he is lacking. The Kite, hot, crazy, and panting mad sweet shackles that tease and excite death itself would drive him wild red blood that turns milky white. I'm trying to pop my neck. <laughs> the dove's hope died. He chose his path. His flapping wings fell still, drenched in scarlet. Here they lay, his cheeks pale white and chill. The owl, who forgot the sky, resigned to his poor earthbound state, hungry or full didn't matter at all. He ate and he ate and he ate. <clears throat> Cock Robin, who hid the key away in ash in the oven. All right. The place he held is empty now, and the doors remain shut tight. The Black Rook is the praying sort who hears the gods in the skies. His whispered petitions go on without end, and glassy and dim are his eyes. Y'all hear that? Spooky. He seeks out her soul by his own and black ambition, frightening her out of her wits, whispering love songs into her ear, what cruel Lynette wants he gets. The grass, the thrush, so loved to eat. Gave him sweet happiness. He sank ever deeper and finally fell to destruction and fatal distress. Who killed Cock Robin? The sparrow, they said. He wants them all dead. To him, honey sweet is their sobbing. <coughs> Damn, that dried the fuck out of my mouth. Okie dokie, all right, uh, so we gotta unlock this thing to get the key that we're looking for. Burn the one who knows no death, pure, adored by those above. No prayers within, just simple love. And now the pinning hunter, the flames longing for his rebirth, a distant breath within the earth. Burn up that heavy body of his, make it wind, or make it wind. Dancing in the sky, that bottomless gut, now a cloud, now a sigh. The sweet blood on his laughing lips now calls him to the gates of hell. There burns everyone that soulless shell. Four bodies return to ashes, thus the door is opened, thus the door is opened. Hard mode is definitely, or hard riddle mode, I should say, is definitely another level of fucking... Uh, the craziness of this game. Oh, fuck. Who was going to figure all this shit out? So apparently the riddle is derived from a nursery rhyme, which I'm not familiar with. It's called Who Killed Cock Robin?
Yeah, I'm not getting into the whole theory bullshit, but uh, passcode is 9271. <laughs> It's better we go and get that key first, so that we can progress through the stage faster. Or level, I should say. Where's she at? Crazy skank nurse. Donde estas? There you are. I ain't playing no fucking games. And I still hear another one. The fuck? What? There's absolutely no points in this fucking room. Literally. Huh. I never understood this. Like, she'll read it, she'll say this. Maybe Leonard? I don't know. Fucking cunt. I knew he was gonna do that.
Yeah, so this is the ceremonial room. We gotta find the room with the plastic bag in it. It's definitely not on this floor either. So it's gotta be... Let's see. Second floor. If we can get there. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear. Oh, I forgot your name. Who are you? Oh, okay, thanks. <laughs> Happy birthday, dear. Who are you? Happy birthday to you. And this is why I like this game. Is this Leonard? <laughs> That's the murder. There's a bunch of uh not my name. Goofy shit that happens. Not your beloved Stanley. It's one of the lighter Silent Hill games, I feel. Underground now. Still freaky, but you could laugh at some parts. Number seven. <laughs> but don't worry about that now. It's time to celebrate your birthday. You've got me mistaken for someone else. Today's not my... I'm not mistaken. Today is your 24th birthday. And I have a present for you. Which do you prefer? To give pain or to receive it? You can have the one you hate the most. <laughs> Happy birthday to you! But you're wrong. It's not my birthday. You sound so upset too. Well, duh, <laughs> this, this phone's not connected. But what about the phone call? Got me. Got me again. <laughs> Motherfucker. Damn, these things are aggressive. All 
All right. Where is that blood room? I believe it is on the first floor. Double check though. You can go to the rooftop. No, it's on the third floor. It's actually circled. I checked. <laughs> That's the elevator, you dumbass. <laughs> My God, <laughs> I hate this level. <laughs>
guess uh, we'll go ahead and burn Leonard. Fuck it. ridiculous dream is over. Well, I guess it's time to dispose of her. The salvation of all mankind. Ha! Why must we reward even the unbelievers? What are you talking about? About our plans, of course. It's true that God is merciful. But first, one must be chosen. Who hearken to the voice of God will be given the keys to paradise. Don't you think so, Mother? Yeah, sure. Go ahead and think whatever you want. <coughs> what do you mean by that? I mean that I don't think the way you guys do. I don't want any part of that kind of paradise. You're an unbeliever. You deceived me! I didn't deceive you. We were both just wrong about each other. I thought you were a normal person. So you tried to trick me so you can run off with my seal, eh? Heretic! You plan to destroy God! I told you I wasn't trying to trick anyone. What is this seal thing anyway? Don't play innocent. You can't fool me anymore. The seal is mine! I was appointed by God to be its guardian! The only thing you'll get from me is a gruesome death. Fuck! Is the flamethrower even working?
guess in easy mode he was easy. I wonder if we can use a machine to kill him. Never actually thought of it. I'm sure if we walked in, there would be fucking dead. Okay, there's got to be a strategy to this because this is just dumb. <laughs> I'm curious. I'm very curious now.
No, it's just literally whacking him until he dies. <laughs> Dumb. Well, I'm pretty sure that ranked up really low. That sucked. <sighs> Leonard's not here anymore. I guess I should head back to the motel now. I hope Douglas is okay. Huh? The seal of Metatron. Megatron. What's this? Metatron. Whatever the fuck you pronounce. It's just a talisman. Alrighty then. Did you send her to my father? Was that wrong? It's your fault that he... Oh, but surely it's a good thing. Uh, it means he was one of God's beloved, no? Those who mock God will never receive salvation. You'll go to hell, Vincent. You'll never feel the joy of God's everlasting paradise. And you think God is going to save you? Ha! Huh. What do you know anyway? I know about the pleasures of this world. And I want to find my happiness while I'm still here. You hated your father, didn't you? This motherfucker cockeyed. <laughs> he kicked you, made you cry. The memory of his cruelty is forever burned into my mind. Yes, yes, and that's why we need God. What you call faith? is nothing more than a child crying out for love. That's why you're all alone. You don't understand. None of you do. Oh, what the fuck? Hey, come back here.
So back to the motel we go. <laughs> well, I mean, I don't know how much faster we could have beat Leonard. I think that's just up to us and how many hits we get to land on them, which aren't many. Where's Douglas? He went out. But he left a message for you. Was there someone else here just now? No, no, just me. Don't you want to know what the message is? Yeah, what did he say? The church is on the other side of the lake. Church? He meant by that. You don't understand? That's where Claudia is. Across the lake. On the north side. If you're going, you better go through the amusement park. It's probably the only way in now. Go northwest on Nathan Avenue. It's a bit far. Hmm, but closer than heaven. Is that it for the message? Uh-huh. Thanks. Douglas really said that? What's wrong? You don't trust me? Not entirely. You weirdo. Come <laughs> on. 
Oh, hell. Oh, hell. I remember the first playthrough I entirely missed this and got killed by the roller coaster. You'd think I wouldn't go on the tracks, why would I, right? <laughs> but I ended up doing it and I got killed because I forgot to turn off the roller coaster. Yep. That's how dumb I am sometimes. <laughs> the fuck. That's all we need to fucking die. <laughs> the girl and you performed serviceably what is it now you lied to me about heather lady i don't like being used lie what lie 
That Heather was kidnapped from you. But it's true. She was originally one of us. That man, Harry Mason, stole her away and kept her hidden from us. Yeah, but she says she was happy. She was brainwashed by him. Deceived, because her true self had not yet awoken. She carries God within her. But when a lesser mother of God truly awakens... Yeah? What's gonna happen? She will usher in the eternal paradise. <laughs> what kind of place is that? A place with no pain, no hunger, no sickness, no old age. There will be no greed or war, and all will live by God's grace alone. No this, no that, no nothing. A paradise? For castrated sheep, maybe. Sounds pretty boring. I pity you. Sounds pretty boring. Understand. <clears throat> You're going to kill me? Is it really so easy for you? I've done it before. Then I truly do pity you. Yeah, we better save uh, this mansion. I have a feeling is going to be tough. Or maybe not. Could be over preparing. Welcome to the Borley Haunted Mansion. Help! Help! <laughs> That's Danny. This mansion is quite old, so please watch your step. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> I did not expect that. Holy fuck. Okay. Hard mode is not fucking around. <laughs> quite old, so please watch your step. Sometimes the floor suddenly gives way, and beneath the floor, there's nothing. Hey, what the fuck? How do we get through? <laughs> oh man. Okay, this is new. This is not what I expected. <laughs> Okay, what the hell are we supposed to do? Come on, man. Uh, do, 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 do. Silent. Let's see, Silent Hill. Spike. Hard.
dumb ass shit. I swear. <laughs> so what you gotta do is unequip your weapon and sneak by it. Like literally, just go into sneak mode. Like that. <laughs> is quite old so please watch your step sometimes the floor I'm so sorry this place is just falling apart the mechanism is broken you see it wasn't supposed to stop there I assure you there's the exit I hope ah, that was supposed to be the exit I hate that <laughs> I fucking knew he was gonna get us. <laughs> I jinxed myself by saying this part was gonna be hard. Th this is what I got. <laughs> I said it, we the haunted mansion. It, I have a feeling it's gonna be hard because of the um, the whole red light puzzle shit. It's more of a trap, not a puzzle. Help! Help! That's Danny. This mansion is quite old, so please watch your step. Sometimes the floor. I'm so sorry. This place is just falling apart. The mechanism is broken. You like, you can't fuck up. You have to, to know there. what is left, what is right. Thank you run into a wall, you're fucked. I hope you enjoyed your tour. Please come back anytime. This is what, this is what I'm going to do. Prefer, we could come and visit you instead. I think I'm going to activate the different control scheme. Maybe that'll help us. Doubt it, but... Instead of 3D, it's 2D. It just help us with the directional. It won't move like a tank. Uh, maybe if we save our game. No, we can't save our game. So. Ah, that was supposed ah. to be the exit. But it seems that no one wants you to leave. Everyone really likes you. They want you to stay with them forever. No, 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 no. <laughs> Fucking go. <laughs> Dying. <laughs> this fucking game, I swear to God. The fucking control scheme's not helping me. It really isn't. We'll keep it at 3D. That's Danny. This mansion is quite old, so please watch your step. I'm so sorry. This place is just falling apart. The mechanism is broken, you see. It wasn't supposed to stop there. I, I guarantee you. you. Assure you. There's the exit. Ah, that was supposed to be the exit. But it seems that no one wants you to leave. Everyone really. No! God! <laughs> stop running into the wall! What if I use the keyboard? I think that's worse. How fucking embarrassing is this? Jesus Christ. What if I use the keyboard? Would that help me? Yeah. 
Hell no. That's even worse. <laughs> I'll just stay with these controls. Oh my god. 4K. quite old, so please watch your step. I'm so sorry. This place is just falling apart. The mechanism is broken, you see. It wasn't supposed to stop there, I assure you. There's the exit. I hope you enjoy Ah, that was supposed to be the exit. But it seems that no one wants you to leave. Everyone really likes you. No! Go! Go! No! Go! I have to agree with them. Like, we, you gotta know the path, you know? Left, right, left, right. <laughs> I keep saying that, and I keep fucking dying. There's gotta be the way to fucking beat it. There just gotta be. mansion. Help! Help! That's Danny. This mansion is... That's filled. Danny. So please watch I'm so sorry. This place is just falling apart. The mechanism is broken, you see. It wasn't supposed to stop there, I assure you. There's the exit. Ah, that was supposed to be the exit. But it seems that no one wants you to leave. Everyone really likes you. They want you to stay with them forever. I have to agree with them. Please don't die. 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 I'll be good, I promise. I'll be good. I almost made it! Ah, fuck you! <laughs> I think I ran out of health on the end, so that didn't help. <laughs> okay. We can do this. I'm fucking getting nervous. <laughs> I don't get nervous in these games. Help! Help! That's Danny. This mansion is quite old, so please watch. I'm so sorry. This place is just falling apart. The mechanism is broken, you see. It wasn't supposed to stop there. I assure you. There's the exit. I hope. Ah, that was supposed to be the exit. But it seems that no one wants you to leave. Everyone. Oh my god. I should have put riddle level normal, <laughs> action level hard. I hope we do get a reward. I think it's the Heather Beam. I, I know. I know what I'm talking about. I, I've played this game a couple times before. I think I beat it on hard once a long time ago on the PlayStation 2. That's Danny. This mansion is quite old. So please watch your. I'm so sorry. This place is just falling apart. The mechanism is broken, you see. It wasn't supposed to stop there, I assure you.
There's the exit. Ah, that was supposed to be the exit. But it seems that no one wants you to leave. Everyone really likes you. They want you to stay with them forever. I have to agree with them. Don't be afraid. Dying is much Dying is blah 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 blah. Somebody shut that fucking guy up. Welcome to the Borley Haunted Mansion. Welcome to Go Help. Fuck Yourself. This mansion is quite old, so please watch. I'm so sorry. This place is just falling apart. The mechanism is broken, you see. It wasn't supposed to stop there, I assure you. There's the exit. Ah, that was supposed to be the exit. But it seems that no one wants to this way, this way. <sighs> Fuck, dude. This sucks. I've died like a hundred times already. Welcome to the Borley Haunted Mansion. The bulletproof vest wouldn't help us here either because we need to have maximum run speed. is quite old so please watch your step I'm so sorry this place is just falling apart the mechanism is broken you see it wasn't supposed to stop there I assure you there's the exit ah, that was supposed to be the exit but it seems that no one wants you to leave everyone really likes you they want you to stay with them forever. I have to agree with No. Them. No. Ah. <laughs> uh, maybe we could. Maybe we could do it. Please. I want to beat this shit already. <laughs> Yes! Oh, yes! We made it! You sons of bitches! Took all my health drinks, but who cares? I'm saving my fucking game. <laughs> Hurrah for the PC version! You can save anywhere. Except that part. Fucking bastards. They know what they were doing. Oh! <laughs> I die! <laughs> oh. What the fuck? That's scary, bro. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen that before.
cow. I'm fucking burning them. Punk ass bitch. I better get the fucking ending I want. All this fucking damage I'm taking. Motherfuckers. to use an ampule it's like a fucking elixir damn near like come on man <laughs> how much more fucking damage could i possibly take throw a dog a bone here man i'm dying Oh, gee whiz, you shouldn't have some fucking shotgun shells. Fuck. <clears throat> nice. Back on fucking yellow. Just what I needed.
Can't move my right leg. I think it's broken. I'll call an ambulance. What? I don't think one will come. She's serious? Don't worry. <laughs> I'm used to it. You. You old fool! Getting yourself hurt like that? Sorry. Why did you have to do that for me? What'll I do if you die? What'll we do if this god thing gets born? <laughs> Come on. How powerful could a god from a dump like this be? <sighs> I'm sure it'll be no big deal. Something's gonna happen. Uh, who knows? Maybe we'd all be better off if it did. But if this is how I got a mercy axe, I don't want to see any more of it. That's a pretty good reason to risk my life, don't you think? Plus, I'm just an old fool, right? You think you're Superman or something? You know, I always wanted to be him. Besides, yeah. I want to help you out. You don't have to feel responsible. I know it's not your fault. You, you remind me of my son. You said nobody was going to cry for you. Dead people don't cry. Stupid kid got himself shot robbing his bank. But why? Maybe because his pop was a penniless good for nothing. Who knows? Anyway, now I guess I'll never find out. <sighs> Sorry. I shouldn't have said you reminded me of a guy like you. <laughs> Well, maybe if you had compared me to your daughter. <laughs> Listen, I'll take care of the rest. You stay here and I'll be back when it's over. You'll be okay by yourself. Hey, no problem. Dad's not around anymore, so only I can do this. What are you doing? Maybe killing you here is the only way to end this nightmare. You might be right. Just came by to make sure you were still alive. Sorry. No! Give him the notebook! <laughs> Come with you if I, wasn't I don't think you're supposed to, but I was kind of curious if you could give it to him. That's the problem with older guys, huh? Uh, 
I'll handle things. You just rest. This one doesn't really change in hard mode, it's pretty much the same. You think they'll give you a health drink or something? No, fuck you. Have a nice day.
shit. Shadow Heather instead of Shadow Link. Stupid shit. 
I think if I didn't have the flamethrower, I'd be 100% screwed right now. But we're almost at the end, so I think we'll be okay. How did you get here? was Vincent, wasn't it? He led you here. When will he cease his meddling? But it's just as well. Luring you here also serves my purposes. Checkmate. Not yet. The time is not yet at hand. The time when all will be forgiven their sins. When the paradise we have long dreamed for will arrive. After the judgment and atonement, an eternity of bliss. Oh, Alessa, the world you wanted is nearly here. That's not what I want. Not you. Alessa, your true self. But I am Alessa. My little Claudia, my dear sweet sister. Alessa, is it you? Oh, how I've missed you. I don't need another world. It's fine the way it is. But you said it yourself. The world must first be cleansed with fire. But that's not what I want now. Alessa, <clears throat> don't you want happiness? Have you become blind to all the hopeless suffering in the world? We need, we all need God's salvation! Listen, suffering is a fact of life. Either you learn how to deal with that or you go under. You can stay in your own little dream world, but you can't keep hurting other people. Besides, I'll never forgive you for hurting my father. I wish only for the salvation of mankind. But for that to happen, the world must first be remade. And for that, we need God. You self-righteous witch! No one asked you to help! Because God grows with hate, fear, and anger. Oh, yes, the kindergartner map. BRB.
Whoops. All right. We won't end it yet. <laughs> All right, so we got to do this. And we have to forgive her so we can get the 1,000 points. I doubt I've uh, actually defeated 200 enemies, but whatever, you know. I know I'll be put to death for the sins I've committed. And I'll go to my death gladly and with a peaceful heart. <laughs> But please, grant me just a small piece of your everlasting mercy. Let me see my child once within your golden gates. Deliver me not to hell, but to purgatory. Allow me to atone for my sins there. I'll stand within the very flames of redemption no matter how they burn me. Forgive me for my wicked act of revenge. <laughs> and deliver the soul of my poor murdered daughter. <laughs> Please, also care for the soul of the girl whose life I have taken. <laughs> God, I am a child, trembling with fear as I stare at death. Soothe my tortured soul with your infinite mercy. Please, forgive me. I forgive you. <gasps> Thank you, Lord. And that's it. We got a thousand points. So that's a total of 1,000 so far. I don't know how much damage I've taken. A shit ton.
<clears throat> so originally to unlock the royal flush costume which i guess is a special unlock because you have to solve a riddle for it you have to find these clues in this library and you, then you have to type in it yeah you have to type it in the uh main menu screen where it lets you unlock it it doesn't do like anything special besides being cosmetic but it's supposed to be like a hard to unlock costume <sighs> hiya heather <clears throat> you show up everywhere don't you you make me sound like some kind of unwanted pest well, who are you anyway? Haven't you realized that yet? Yeah, you're on Claudia's side. I told you not to put me in the same category as that mad woman. Well, you're pretty loony yourself. It's true. We believe in the same God. But I'm quite sane. So why did you help me out then? Was that also part of trying to resurrect God? It's not uncommon for people to worship the same God and still disagree. God? Are you sure you don't mean devil? Whichever you like. The point is that now I really am on your side. I don't want God to be born. Wouldn't be... Convenient. Much too unpredictable. So you've been using me to stop Claudia, is that it? Do your own dirty work. My dirty work? I think we both had our own interests in mind. You hate her too, don't you? You're the only one who can get it done. I don't have powers like you two. Besides, I always hated getting all hot, sweaty. <laughs> oh, really? I'm just looking out for myself. Everyone does it. <laughs> the way he says that, hmm. You're the worst person in this room. You come here and enjoy spilling their blood and, and listening to them cry out. You feel excited when you step on them and snuff out their lives. Are you talking about the monsters? They look like monsters to you? Oh, no. Don't worry. It's just a joke. <laughs> uh, and that's why a theory exists behind this guy. Did you get the seal of Metatron? What's that? You don't have it? Leonard was carrying it. You mean this thing? Yes, that's it. As long as we have that, we're fine. Here, take this.
Really, I need stun gun batteries. Sweet.
Ah, there's two of these fuckers. Color popped. What the fuck? Fuck. <laughs> this is a kill room. Nah, let's get the fuck out of here. He's about about to kill all these guys. I wish, but no. No thanks. about what happened here 17 years ago. You've been here a long time. You must have heard some details. A group of pagans, blinded by earthly desires, spit in the very face of God. They tried to use the seal of Metatron to prevent God's awakening. But God drove the unbelievers away and threw them into the abyss. But due to their wickedness, God was unable to be born properly. And so, she has slumbered ever since in the womb of the Holy Mother until the time of the awakening. That's all that I know. That's it, huh? Well, thanks. Father Vincent, I heard that the Holy Mother has been found. Is it true? Alessa has been found? Did Claudia say that? Yes. Then it must be true. Her sight rarely fails her. Bless the Lord. Maybe it's because of her great faith. But I could never be like her. I wouldn't want to. Nor I. The truth is, Sister Claudia frightens me a little. Well, now, let's both show our faith by forgetting about this little talk, okay? Yes, but does that mean this land will finally be the home of eternal paradise? If God wills it, my sister. If God wills it.
Claudia Wolf. Yeah, <laughs> Ooh, that's uh, not going to really help, um, but yeah, that's how hard it is. So apparently you have to make out the Roman numerals, and there aren't that many, so... Mm. Yeah, hard solution. Let's see. What the hell does it say? Okay, so. Yeah. Alright, so the high priestess here. The knight here. The fool. Here, the sun or moon, and then the hangman, her. I want? Well, for the two of you to die, that would be nice. Then I could relax. When did you stop believing in God? God lives. Just look around you. But I do believe in her. In my own way. I fear her, and I adore her. But I haven't lost my mind like you. You think that this is the work of God? Isn't this all nothing more than your own personal nightmare? Just like Alessa 17 years ago? 
If this really is the work of God, then I'd say she has lousy taste. You mock God? Traitor, you will go to hell. Not that again! Who do you think you are claiming to know God's will? Go home, Vincent! Home? This church is my home. I built it with my power. The power of money that you view with such scorn. Although, I admit that this atrocious scenery is all yours. If you continue to get in my way... Then you'll kill me. Well... <laughs> well... The guest of honor has arrived. Let's get this party started. Heather, go ahead and kill this crazy bitch. This demon who claims to speak for God. The time has come. You can kill her now. You go to hell! What did you do? Mm, nothing important. You're not going to run? I guess this is the end. No, the beginning. As Vincent said, the time has come. Alessa, I'm saddened that you didn't agree to this on your own. But I thank you for nurturing God with all the hate in your heart. It's time for mankind to be released from the shackles of sin which bind them. But a God born from hatred can never create a perfect paradise. Happy people can be so cruel. Is it so hard to believe that sympathy could be born out of pain and suffering? Why do you reject God's mercy? Why do you cling to this corrupt world? You know that only God can save us. And save you too? Happy ending? piece of junk. What do you think you can do with that? Do you really think it can kill God? I'm sorry to see you fell for my father's foolishness. What? You're pathetic. God. 
God loves even you. Now, Alessa, there's nowhere else to run. Called her a whole ass bitch. Looks like God didn't make it. Stop! God is... Claudia! Oh. <laughs> I could never get used to this part. It's fucking disgusting. There's no saving our game.
So all we gotta do is um, <clears throat> deliver the final blow with a melee weapon so we can unlock the beam saber. My goodness, what the fuck? Damn. Definitely a lot more aggressive. Well, we can skip the scene so we don't have to watch it again. I wonder where do you use the sealed metal tron? Where the hell Leonard go? Or I'm sorry, Vincent. Never noticed that. gonna be here all fucking night <laughs> hopefully not
Come on! <laughs> uh, what are we gonna do, man? I hope that continues don't fuck up our rank. That probably does, but whatever. That didn't do anything, but okay. Bitch. So I guess that's what we got to do, just kind of strike, run in a circle, strike, run in a circle. So I've noticed if we don't use firearms, we're okay. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck this game, man. Well, hard mode. I love this game, don't get me wrong, it's just hard mode, it's so stupid.
Make sure we got everything. Yep. Mm, yep. Ah, bitch. Nah, she still got me. Fucking cunt. <laughs> we gotta bust a U turn. Come on. We'll find the strategy. This bitch is a motherfucker in hard mode, man. Yeah, we got plenty of beef jerky, though. Woo wee! Can't forget that. <laughs>
That thing's too slow. I mean, what can we do? Just keep going with the katana, I guess. I got smacked and burned. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny as hell, uh, Scully. <laughs> oh, that, that that was too good, man. <laughs> yeah, I got fucking 28 pieces of it. Might as well. <laughs> <sighs> you had to smack the shit out of me, didn't you?
I mean, guns don't work either. It's like, whatever the fuck I use, I'm gonna die. I'm really short health items. I mean, we could try and just kind of wither her, wither her down. Okay, let's use a flamethrower. Because why not? It's working. Holy fuck, she can't see me. Let's go in for the blow. Yeah, I'm in the glitchy fucking spot. See, this is how I beat her on the PS2 version on hard mode. <laughs> Fuck you, bitch. Eat shit. I'm saying, man. <laughs> Maybe it was a uh, Easter egg or a secret nobody knew about in a hundred years this game has been released. <laughs> Not really a hundred years, but since 2003. But I beat her the same way on the PS2 version, like I said earlier. It's fucking nuts. <laughs> hey, I welcome it. I don't give a shit. Just getting my ass handed to me multiple times. I'm staying right fucking here, man. <laughs> I'm saying, man. <laughs> Y'all saw it here on Twitch. I just beat this bitch on hard mode with a glitch. <laughs> now nah, y'all pass it along on YouTubes and see, look, you stand right here and you got it made, man. Is that the end? Thanks, Gully. Now, let's hope we got the possessed ending, because that kind of was the point of the replay. Dad. <laughs> Dad.
Ah, when her tears are stuck. <laughs> oh, that sucks. I noticed that last time too when I was playing. Her tear kind of glitched out. Come on, possessed ending. Oh, yeah. It definitely is the possessed ending. This didn't happen last time. Yeah, early 2000 games, they weren't great graphically, but I think gameplay-wise and story-wise, they were always made really good. Oh fuck, she killed Douglas. PC team. Ending type possessed. Cool. Hard. Hard. Three hours, all right. One hour less than last time. Yeah, that split worm messed me up. On to the next, definitely. I'm not really going for the UFO ending. I think I'm gonna just go over to Silent Hill 4 tomorrow or whenever I stream next. Missionary, one minute. Leonard, six minutes. I'd even get one star. Wow. But God, it took me three minutes to kill it with the katana. Oh, wow. Defeated enemy by fighting. I so I didn't even shoot him. So I guess the flamethrower counts as a melee weapon. That's why. Yeah, but I had the help of the flamethrower and they docked me a fucking star for it. That's cool though. Ooh, I got the beam saber. And unlimited submachine gun. Fuck that. Who's gonna play fucking extreme? some crazy asshole. I'm curious how the beam saber looks. Is it like in your inventory? No, I think you have to pick it up. The unlimited submachine gun. Yeah, that running animation, right? It's fucking nuts.
Oh, where can I beam saber be? Yeah. Fuck the map. Who needs it? I don't. Shoot everywhere till he fucking dies. <laughs> it's pretty powerful. I wonder if it's in the bakery. Just give it to me already. Flamethrower. So where the fuck is the beam saber? Am I watching this? Where the fuck is the beam saver? <laughs> You'd think they'd just give it to you in your inventory. Usually that's what Risen Evil does. This isn't Risen Evil though. I'm curious where it's at. Uh, SH3 beam saver. It's like a fucking lightsaber. Yeah, uh huh? And the melee also appears. Pero donde esta? It can be found on a door as the doorknob in the second floor in North Corridor of Central Square Shopping Center. Yeah, it's pretty fucking annoying. What? <laughs> it's found on a door as a doorknob on the second floor uh, in the north corridor. What? So like up here somewhere? He had no chance. I'm saying, man, I want my fucking beam saber. <laughs> this 
the good thing is we beat hard mode first instead of normal mode first. I already beat easy mode on accident because I thought I was on normal mode. So we can beat it a third time with the beam saber if we wanted to, to unlock the uh, heather beam. One of these fucking doorknobs has it. Oh, wait, we didn't pick up the map. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> and you said you didn't need maps. It's got to be on one of these doors. <laughs> no, it's not. Doesn't look like a beam saber. That doesn't either. That doesn't either. That doesn't either. Oh, here it is. I got the beam saber. Stupid ass was right there the whole time. A sword shining with a strange force. The switch turns the blade on and off. Ooh. Ah, get the fuck out of here. Look at this shit. <laughs> you gotta admit, I'm saying, it, bro. <laughs> you gotta admit, that's pretty fucking awesome. <laughs> It was so worth beating the game on hard mode. So if you hold A, she does like a um, vertical strike, and the normal is just a horizontal. And apparently, there's a way to double it in um, length if you beat the game with a perfect rank, whatever that means. Alright, well, that was fun. I guess I'm going to stop there. <laughs> I'm getting tired, and this hard mode playthrough really took a lot out of me, man. Definitely worth it. But uh, thank you for stopping by, Scully and Ham. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Uh, I'll probably, like I said, start for tomorrow. Not not tomorrow, I'm sorry. Uh, sometime in the week. <laughs> you too. Have a great night, Scully. Thank you for stopping by. And hopefully you can follow if you haven't already. But yeah, have a good night, guys. And uh, this has been fun. <laughs>